you know, boil the tiniest bit of water for a cup of tea in them. Yes. You know what I'm saying? They're just one of those things that you... And by the way, Do if you, you have little hands yeah. in oh, the kitchen and yeah. you're trying to get them to not be scared... That's of a cooking, great, yes. that's a great way to pull them into the, because it looks like it should be in a doll set, right? <laughs> With Absolutely. Yeah. What's, what's, a, what's a spice that we don't toast typically here in the States that we should? Well, I mean, really you should toast them all. Okay. Um, but you know, we think of black pepper as a spice. Yes. I know that we just kind of, we grind it maybe fresh, which you toast should. It. Uh, but if you toasted it and then you ground it, oh my gosh, it brings out this fruitiness and this nuttiness. She's that blowing is so my mind. Beautiful, yeah. You're the blowing my mind. Black pepper comes from the part of India that I'm from, oh. so I have a real like affinity for it, and I'm yeah. just sort of like, it's a spice, you guys. Embrace her for all she Love has it. to offer. Uh, I put it in everything. Yeah. I should have known. Yeah. Um, okay, we're going to talk about top-down cooking, bottom-up cooking, all at the same time. This is Artie's five quart printed medallion Dutch oven with the glass so lid. It's a five core capacity, all stovetop friendly, mm -hmm. oven safe. Uh, I have stainless steel, aluminum, and silicone. So the handles are stainless yes. steel. That aluminum is a great conductor of heat. It Correct. distributes the heat evenly. Yes. Um, you have a little silicone on the handles, but non-stick ceramic interior. Yes, so Love. and the thing that was important to me with this guy is will it still brown? If it's nonstick, because that's a real thing for chefy chef I chefs. I bet. Um, or people that hang around chefy chef chefs. <laughs> is, <laughs> will it brown? You know what I mean? And so you can see, listen, honey, that is like nearly my skin tone. It went brown. Oh, um, beautiful for all that comforting cooking that you would do this time of year. These are short ribs. So we're just going to throw our veggies in here. Very similar to And the I'll just roast. point while you do, you're yes. using the saffron color, that yes. rich red. Yes. The color right next door to it is juniper. That's that medium denim blue. If you want mm -hmm. the blue, get the juniper. The one on the other side of it it is turmeric. That's that gorgeous harvest gold. There's only 550 of those to go around. Mm. And then over here in front of me, we have the white truffle. <laughs> and there's fewer than 800 to go around there. I yeah. love this. I love the florals. I love the little medallion. Mm -hmm. But um, Dutch ovens typically are 13 pounds or more. The this heavy. one is less than five. Yeah, so the thing that was important that. to me here was I wanted it to obviously be beautiful, yeah. bring it from the stove to the table, um, but also that it would perform, right? Yeah. Like that it would give you all of the durability and all the cooking that you're used to doing in that heavy Dutch oven, you can do in here. And it's still a good size. It's a good size that you're not having to haul it from here to there and find extra space for it. Yeah. But it's a good enough size that I've got three gigantor short <laughs> ribs in here. Now and what size is your family? Uh, I have four. You have four? Yeah. Would this feed four? Um, you know, my husband's a big eater. <laughs> This would be his also servant. same. I'll be also, I'll be honest about that one. Yes, <laughs> but yeah, you know, it, but it's also it's again, it's the kind of thing that you can cook so much of your sort of fall and winter specials yeah. in this guy and then bring it right to the table. And so many of us maybe have a cookware set that we love, mm -hmm. but we didn't get this size pot right. with it. Right. So it's great, but with the lid, mm -hmm. now we're top down and bottom up yes. cooking and creating right. almost that oven on the stove top. Yes, correct, exactly, right? exactly. Um, I wanted to show you what else you can make in it. Let's see. Just give you some more ideas. And by the way, one of the things that we didn't say about this that yes. is so cool is because these are silicone, you can use them in all of your different pots and pans. The utensils, oh yeah. Right? So this yeah. is non-stick, so you would want to be a little careful and make sure that you use silicone tools in it. A little bit more it. aware, yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah. But, um, but you don't have to worry about it if you have these. Anyway. Sounds like this, a lot of people do already. Yeah, they get, and, yeah oh, they're ordering those like crazy. Good, this goes in the oven. Okay. Uh, 350, I believe. It's, I think, 350 with the lid. 350 with the and lid. And 400. 400 without it. Yeah, so it's pretty high. So this, I know, you're like, what is that? Oh, wait. It's chili. It's a tamale pie. So you start the chili she cooked in it on the, the bottom. And then you pour your cornbread mix over the top. Are there and forks bake it off. in this vicinity? <laughs> I'll I use my hands. Right I will use my hands. I know, right? Look at that. And that was all in one pot. Can I hit that with a Yes, little? please. Do a little green right on top. I'm, yep. get, uh -huh. I'm not She's wrapping up out. anything. <laughs> not wrapping up anything. Well, they're you, like, you go ahead. They're like, we have a busy show. We got to wrap up. I'm like, that's too bad. Well, that's too bad because we also I'm have kidding. dessert. We also have dessert on the table. 
So this is a cobbler. You again, cook, cook, you know, soften that fruit, get it nice and luscious, throw that cobbler topping over the top, throw it in the oven. Great, good, oh so good. <laughs> I love that. I love an all Ebony, in one. you gotta try this. All it's so in good. one. Wait, now I wanna try it. Do, so we, do we have to move on? You gotta get in there. I gotta get in there. You gotta get in there. That is stinking gum. Isn't that good? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so thank comforting. God, it's comfort food season. <laughs> I would, this house was built on comfort food. This was not <laughs> twigs not and moss. Yeah, and, no. me too. Me too. Um, so we do have um, the turmeric, the juniper, the saffron. That's the yellow, blue, and red. And we also have the white truffle. Okay, wrapping up, I promise. $42.98 to get it home. Ele oh, Lord. 